following criticism from the NNPGs on the highest offer remark by UDA chairman T.R. Zelian. The latter defended his stand today, stating that his statement has been misunderstood. Talking to Northeast Live, UDA chairman T.R. Zeliang said that there was no hidden agenda or motive behind his statement, asking the government of India for the highest offer it can make to solve the Naga issue. Zeliang said that in the wake of the stalemate between the government of India and the NSC and IM on the issue of flag and constitution, it was important to play a facilitator's role to bring the negotiating parties on common ground as far as the vexed issue is concerned. Zeliang said that the core committee wanted to get a clear stand of the center which could then be conveyed to the NSC and IM. But now, they, they, some group always misconstrued about my statement. Talking about the highest offer from government of India means NSC and IM and government of India both the stand are quite opposite, and there was no meeting point. Government of India said that constitution and flag is not negotiable. And on the other hand, NSCN, IM, TH Muiva told us very clearly that uh, uh, without, without flag and constitution, they will not sign any uh, accord or agreement. So they have arrived at the deadlock, almost deadlock, deadlock. So in the month of October last year, 2021, when Chief Minister and myself met Yaki Misra, we told him very clearly that please meet Prime Minister and Home Minister and come back to us what will be the highest offer from government of India on the issue of flag and constitution. So that with this message, we can take it to NSC and IM and 7 and NPG. Why I said this was that it should be transparent. The people deserve to know where are we going to arrive at. So my statement to this channel that we have questioned the government of India, the, the highest offer to come to amicable settlement on the issue of flag and uh, constitution. People take it otherwise, that the highest offer may be some other package or something else, but th that is totally wrong. We want to bring both the negotiating group to a meeting point, that is the that is the reason that we have questioned AK Misra. AK Misra. And meanwhile, Zeliang also added that the core committee will address the concerns of the NNPGs separately. Yeah, yesterday we discussed about this. And uh, we have explained, we have explained in detail to all the members, UDA members. Uh, 60 members were there. And we have uh, categorically explained about our position on the on the on the issue of this uh, highest offer mm. and since we requested all the groups Naga Degosti group uh, not to not to go to the media mm. against each other so when we have told them not to go to the media we don't want to we don't want to issue any rejoinder on this but yesterday in the UDA meeting we have decided that the core committee on Naga political issue should invite 7 NNPG and clarify our position through that meeting. So that was decided yesterday. And furthermore, Zeliang added that the core committee will go to Delhi post the government formation in five states. Yeah, we expect. We expect that we'll be invited, but whether we are invited or not, we'll go back after this uh, formation of the government in the five state. So very soon we'll, we'll uh, visit Delhi and meet uh, Home Minister.